Happy Friday! Happy Hanukkah! Is Hanukkah. <laughs> Hanukkah is Friday. We're getting gas at Sam's. But I need to go pick up that size 6 long sleeve shirt. So that's what we're going to go do real quick before my husband has to go back to work. And then she wants to run to Ollie's to pick up some Littlest Pet Shop exclusive figure. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. And then I have to go home and get to work. She's got to do schoolwork. It's a vicious cycle. Hey guys, we're at Ollie's. I went to Walmart to get the shirt. They didn't have any. Even though I had it in my grasp yesterday. So I ended up having to get a Fruit of a Loom size six, seven long sleeve shirt. So hopefully that'll work. I mean, there isn't much I can do if I can't find the shirt. I just got a Big Mac. There's a hole in my Big Mac. But look, you can just like. Can you see through your hat? <laughs> Meat so thin, you can. Deja vu. This is deja vu. Really? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow, man, I'm getting bad deja vu off that. Well, it's probably because I vlogged it and, you know, we watched this vlog before. <laughs> I don't know what made me want to open up my sandwich anyway, but... <laughs> it stinks. Thanks. Hey guys, it is... It is, it is 5.18. And uh, I'm getting down. I'm getting down. I'm getting down with myself. All by myself here. I'm getting down. No, I'm getting ready to go downstairs. I, we, I hurried up. I got that order printed out and printed, heat pressed. I already had it um, printed out on the transfer paper. So I, we went to the post office. I got that shipped out. Then we ran to Bilo so I could pick up a cake for my husband. It's his birthday tomorrow. And I went ahead and I picked up another cake for a girl that goes to our church because her birthday was yesterday. And um, it, was, it would be my husband's cousin who is like my best friend down here. Um, she called and she was like, what are we going to do? Are we going to do something for Ashley? So I was like, yeah, you know, I'm going to go pick up a cake for Sterling. So I'll pick up a cake for her. So I got her a cake and I'll show you guys later. But you would think that when you say, can you write something on this? They would kind of match up colors. No, like the cake I got Ashley was, has a lot of, it was blue and green and purple. I get it. It had a little butterfly because I really don't know what she likes. So I just picked out something that was pretty. And the lady put hot pink. Wrote her name. Wrote happy birthday in hot pink. Like it doesn't even match the cake at all. And then for my husband because he really liked that whipped frosting. that Because for my birthday he picked up a cake and it had whipped frosting on it in I'm not a fan of the whip frosting. I just think it kind of like coats the top of your mouth and kind of greasy. But he liked it. So it was the only cake I could find that had the whipped frosting. I probably should have just made a cake, but um, it was the only cake I could find. And so that one is kind of like yellow and light blue. Yeah. And she wrote his name in green. Happy birthday. And it doesn't match the cake, but that's all right because green is his favorite color. So, whatever. So I had to make room in the refrigerator to stick two cakes, which, you know, I had to do a lot of shuffling. But anyway, it is 5:20 right now. I bought stuff to make pizza, so I don't know if we're gonna eat here. I don't know. I know he said he's tired, so he probably just wants to stay in tonight. So I bought stuff to make pizza. We've got green pepper and we got onion and we got stuff that we can put on pizza so I just picked up some cheese and some pepperoni and then I ended up buying just the dough the Pillsbury dough that comes in a can like the biscuits I just bought that so um, we'll just make some pizzas later I guess 
But I'm gonna head downstairs. I got lots of orders I need to get done. I need to make a ribbon trim, which that's what I'm going to go do right now. I'm going to go make this ribbon trim. And I just received a message from somebody and it just, sometimes, I don't know. It's like, do people not understand how Etsy works? <clears throat> she was like, I still have not received this item. You have confirmation that it was sent? Confirmation on every order I send because I ship through Etsy. So I said, if you looked in your purchase items, there will be track tracking information. It was shipped on the 3rd and it said it was available for pickup at your P.O. box since October 5th. So today is the 14th, so this package has been sitting at her post office for 7, 8, 9 days. I can't help it if you don't know. I don't know. I can't help people that don't understand. Because if it was me and if something I ordered something, I would go and I'd probably track it. Just like I did earlier, I had to track something. I ordered some stabilizer and I wanted to know if it was shipped. And so I tracked it and it was shipped out today. So I know it's on its way. And if it don't show up, you know, in a few days, I probably expect it Monday. So if it don't show up on Monday, I'll go back and I will track it again to see where it's at. That's how it works. It just, sometimes it just gets to you. I mean... A lot of things get to you after a while and you know on a normal day maybe it might not bother me as much maybe it'll just be like oh you got to track your item but then on Sundays you know things just eat at you I think it was the whole issue with the shirt the shirt the, you know wanting a certain size I couldn't find that size I only had v-neck then they decided they want long sleeves so I passed up a long sleeve shirt and then went to another store and they were all out. Went to another store and they were all, you know, it's just, I feel like I'm on a wild goose chase is what I feel like. And then, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. So tomorrow is my husband's birthday. I plan on taking him out and right now I want to go try to get some work done. Pizza is what's for dinner. Oh my gosh, that's Where are we at? <laughs> Dollar General. We're at the Dollar General. My husband had to run in here. I didn't make um I didn't make the ribbon trim yet. I just made dinner <laughs> and then my husband said, get ready, because he wants to go pick up that microwave, I think. But we were sitting here. <laughs> my husband had to run in there. We're sitting in the car. And what happened, Sterling? No, you're <laughs> <laughs> what happened, Sterling? I bet y'all were freaking out. Was you vlogging that? No. no, I was watching a vlog and I just happened to look over and Sterling said, Mom, Mom. So I just saw that lady and I was like, obviously she's, you know, wrong car. That's what I was thinking. So I just locked the doors. I made sure they were locked. And then you come out. Oh, you wasn't filming that? No, I wasn't. Oh, man, you should have been filming that. Oh, this, this lady trying to break into my car. <laughs> I thought, that Stur lady's going to kick me. Was the, was, was the car locked? Yeah, well, I think it was already locked. But well, she might have got in the car with you, bless her heart. I made sure it was locked. <laughs> she says, I saw her kept trying to key. Well, she, and I says, she hey. Bumped, she bumped into the side of the car with her buggy. Buggy, yeah. And then Sterling said, I, Mom! 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 She said she can't see, obviously. She don't need to be on the road. I don't remember how she said she was, but I said, uh, she says, I said, that's not your car. She says, no wonder my key don't work. I'm so sorry. I said, that's my wife sitting right there. I thought that was my daughter. I says, well, what? I said, do you have a van? No, it's like a pickup truck. Okay, well, what car? It's a Nissan. I says, well, let's look over here. I'm looking for a truck. Yeah. She's in like a little some compact car over here. And I'm like, here's a Nissan. I think I see it. So we go over there and she's talking about getting pulled over and charged $185. And then she she unlocks it. Then she tries to open that back door. She can't. So she hits a button. Still don't get it. Hits another button. Still don't get it. Finally she hits the lock, but it locks everything. And I says, Hit, push it the other direction. She unlocked it. 
Yeah, I'm, I don't know how. Tell your wife I'm sorry. I said, she'll be all right. <laughs> Bless her heart. She don't need to be on the road. Well, I just, like I, I just assume. She like, said she lost her glasses. She can't see nothing. Oh, my goodness. And she's driving. Obviously. Mm. I can't get Uncle Brian to help me because of his back. I can get Daddy to help me. That actually seemed easy. So we got a microwave. Yes, ma'am. It's it's new, but it was an open box. Look at that. Well, it's a display. A display from it's Best creepy. Buy. Look at the moon. Oh, here you go. Here's the party. Here's the cat Yeah. Man, something stinks. It smells like fish camp. We're at the Mighty Dollar. You want to go in here and find some good junk at the Mighty Dollar? How many dollars you got? You didn't get that. Let me see, let me see you. It's 1201. Happy, Happy birthday to you. You look like a monkey. I thought she was going to say Fu Manchu. Happy birthday. Thank you. You look wonderful. Thank you. For being 53. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you don't look a day over 35. You don't know how hard I'm fighting to stay awake at this hour. Did you stay up just because it's your birthday? No, the movie just went off. So. Well, perfect timing. Let's go eat some cake. Cake, 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 cake. Can we? No. Hey guys, it is 1 o'clock in the morning on my husband's birthday it's october 15th now but um i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog i had to make a ribbon trim which i think i showed really and then i embroidered out a gobble to you wobble dogs out there barking but it was part of the three i have three um thanksgiving sets which i still have to package up the tutus but i did manage to get the little shirts um and i have to go get one more shirt downstairs so hopefully I will get up in time and package up the tutus and put them in a box and print the shipping label um, I'm scheduled to pick up for the one box I already have so if I get the other one out that's a bonus but I do plan on taking my husband out tomorrow to eat and celebrate his birthday so anyway I'll see you guys tomorrow thanks for watching guys bye